This is the girls' uh, 2005 Camry XLE, and this is uh, the passenger side front door here. And for some reason, on the very bottom, I don't know why, but there's surface rust here. So what I'm going to do today is sand this down. Yeah, it's a little bit of surface rust. It's not on any of the other doors. It's just this door. So what I'm going to do is get this, uh, here you go, sand it down and get some Rust-Oleum reformer put on there. And uh, just as a preventive so that this doesn't get any worse. Okay? Not that it's going to get worse, but rust never ceases unless you stop it. I mean, it's, I mean... It's not in anything. I mean, it's uh, very uh, solid. But we might as well do a little prevention here today, okay? Well, we have a bigger problem here. I, I pulled this, uh, I don't know what you call it, this uh, stuff off of here because I could tell that there was... Um, there was um, rust like in there and I'm thinking I don't know what happened here maybe the uh, you know stuff coming out of the door you know got underneath the uh, looks like it got underneath this uh, you know maybe the stuff in the door got underneath this uh, stuff here but you can see that there's a bunch of rust in here so I'm going to see what I can do for sandpapering this off. I can tell you right now why this rust appeared. It's because at some point someone did work on this door. And what they did was they put a bead of caulk in here like this. And what that did was rather than let the water come out of the door and flow away, it trapped it behind it. And... Uh, so here's the weep hole, so it would come out and just stay trapped behind it, and then it just started rusting. So it's been rusting for a long time. I don't know when the door was ever fixed. Maybe it's on the Carfax, but uh, I mean, it's, the, the, the metal's all solid. There's no holes or anything in there, so we can, uh, we can prevent this from getting worse, absolutely. Hey, hey, so let me tell you where I am in my process here preparing. Of course, I, I use sandpaper to get all this stuff along the bottom sanded, and I used uh, I also used a uh, razor blade to scrape off any loose um, paint as best I could. Okay, that's good. And then if you go around the front, I also found some some rust that was under the paint so I have uh, scraped that off as best I could there's a little bit here oh, I didn't get the back here I'm just gonna stick with the front door today and uh, I got a little bit here and there's a couple little things there but that's basically what I've got now I washed that all off with the Dawn dishwashing liquid of course after it was sanded and everything so it's uh, because the instructions on the bottle say wash it with soap rinse it and I'll let it dry here I used a microfiber cloth to dry it so just let it dry some more and I'm gonna do some taping now alrighty this is a uh, like interim here I've got uh, tape on the front here and I'm gonna get a plastic bag to put up on the door so I'm um, I've taped this oh I gotta get some more over there okay so we've got this stuff here and uh, I think I can just I made it kind of straight so it would look kind of nice you know so and then on the other side here let's take a look under here I've got tape and I've got to get the uh, I'm gonna tape this whole door with uh, some plastic garbage bags okay so we'll see what happens I'm working on it man fire trucks are coming by what's going on I'm about ready to uh, 
to spray paint here. I've got um, everything pretty much masked. Well, not pretty much, but I, I have things all masked off. And uh, I should just be able to spray the paint. I washed it. It's dry. And uh, let's take a look at the front. Kind of got the same thing here. I'm, I'm taped up on the bottom so I can just get the uh, get the bottom done. And uh, okay, we'll see what happens. We're looking at the instructions here, and uh, it says, you know, outdoors 15 to 90 degrees. That's good. Humidity's below 65. I think that's good. Prep. Remove loose paint and rust with a wire brush, sandpaper, light gossy surfaces clean with soap and water i did rinse on a try okay um so painting shake can vigorously for one minute after ball starts banging okay and then hold uh, the can 10 to 16 inches from the surface spray in a steady back and forth motion lightly over tapping each time keep the can the same distance Keep the can in motion while spraying. For best appearance, apply two light coats a few minutes apart. Okay, all right, there we go. Okay, so let's see what we got here. No. Okay. I think that's about a minute. So, let me just see. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So, let's try. Oh, that's what it does. Just like that. Okay. Whew. I can smell it. Okay. Whoops. Keep it in motion. Okay. <laughs> oh, boy. Keep it farther away. Okay. It's dripping a bit, and that's because you gotta be a little farther away. Keep it in motion, it says. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. Well, let me see. Uh, whew, boy, that smells. All right, so, <coughs> did I miss anything? Okay. Yeah, okay. Well, hang on. I have, okay. Well, okay. Okay, so. Whoops, I missed the pot. Okay, I missed the spot. That's okay. Well. Whew. Okay, so. Let me see if I got everything that I need. I think so. Nope, nope, I missed the spot. Missed the spot. Okay. That's good. All right. So, we're going to wait a couple minutes <coughs> and put the second coat on. Oh, where's my timer? Okay. Okay. <coughs> Let's put the timer on. Okay. All right. Clock. Start. We'll go two minutes. couple light coats. <coughs> 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 Woo! Man! <coughs> Boy! Even with the mask on, that paint is crazy. Wow! Even with the mask, the paint is pretty crazy. Whoa, I missed some. Oh, 
I didn't get it off. Where's the buck? Where's the thing? Yay. I did not get spots here. So let me come back under here. Let me see. There, now I can see there. Okay, so. Yeah. Alright, so I see. I. So now it's, I think I got it all. Okay, hey, <laughs> is it working? I hope so. So we're gonna wait, we'll put the, another light second coat on. Holy bunga. So anyways, this was my job today. And uh, I'm hoping that we're able to stop this uh, rust a bit that was creeping in under the door. And what I'll do is I'll get some uh, touch-up paint <coughs> and be able to touch it up. Nice. Okay. Let me see. Two light coats. So. Okay. Yeah, it's okay. Let's see. Good, I guess. Nice breeze out here today. Okay. Thing is, I can't see with these glasses. I can't see with them. I can't see without them. All right. So, another light coat. Let's see what we do. Okay. You know. Okay. How many minutes? It's been three minutes and 19 seconds. So we will let it go one more minute because <clears throat> I did that extra spray and let's keep shaking this thing up. Okay. Once again, this is instantly converts rust to a protected paintable surface. That's what we want. Missed the spot. Dog on it. Okay, well, maybe that's why I gotta put two light coats on. I tell you, these gloves are causing me problems. They're just really sweaty. It's hard to move my fingers in them. Alright, so let's go here. Whoops. Okay, 18 inches. Forth. I'm gonna get something up underneath there too. Okay. Let me see. Okay. That's good. And uh make sure I got all open. Okay. There you go. Looking uh I think it's looking okay. Looks like I got everything coated nicely. Ouch. Okay. 
Okay, I think that's it. Just let her dry a bit. And I'll take the uh, stuff off. happening there oh that's just gonna require a little sanding I think it's okay all right okie dokie all right let's just take a closer look and uh, this right here needs a bit of sanding that's okay that looks pretty good. Let's get around the other side here. And, uh, okay. Um, looks like I've got it pretty nicely coated underneath here. I can see, yep, that looks pretty good. And up underneath. I think what I need to do now is let's just, uh, Let's take everything. Uh, let's take everything off. Now, I guess there's no reason to try save this tape. <laughs> you know. Okay. So, let's see. What we got. some blue tape in here and I think I'm just gonna leave it <laughs> because I'm gonna come back and put another coat on and if I leave this here hmm, I don't know should I take it off so that ew, I don't know let's see okay, well oof bench Now, I'm trying to take the tape off here. Make sure I don't peel the. I don't want to peel the tape off. That's okay. I 
figure it out. can see one one flaw that I've got here and that is that uh, oh, this tape this, this tape will take the uh, I've still got to get this in here. So how am I gonna do that? <laughs> oh my, maybe I'll just use a brush. I get a little brush and get it. We don't have any overspray. I think I overkilled on the on the uh, masking here, but I'd rather be safe than Next. Okay. 
looking good here. Nice. So the door here has some very little spots of rust and uh, I didn't, and uh, there's, a, there's a bigger one right here. So I am going to use this little brush to uh, take care of those, I think. Okay, so what I'm doing is I have this little, little uh, pie pan and I'm gonna just spray some paint in there. So, and I have this little tiny brush, so let me see if I can, you know, this isn't working too well because this brush, the bristles are too big. So, let me try something else. Okay. I am back with a brush that has smaller and more tight bristles, so I can kind of like dab the... Uh, dab the uh, paint on here there you go that works nice oh much more controlled there okay and uh once again i can't see with the sun and everything it's pretty crazy all right that's all right let me get down here oh now i can see all right okay it's okay Okay. Okay. There we go. That's nice. Oh, look at this. Yeah, that's good. This stuff dries pretty fast, though. Okay, so we're just putting a little bit of dab on here on these nicks. Nice. There you go. Whoops, get off of there. Ah, boy, this stuff is sticky once it gets on there, you know? All right, so, and this is the bigger spot right here. regular Picasso here you know <laughs> I'm like Leonardo da Vinci when it comes to this now look at this okay so Let's hit that. okay that's good oh now down here I need some more because somehow we missed that I don't know how I missed it but I missed it that's okay Whoa, not doing good. I, oh, I need some wetter stuff here. Okay. Okay. Ooh, stuff smells. I gotta tell you. Breathe it in you. You're, you're having a problem. Okay, so I'm gonna try and make a nice. Uh, Like Triple A was down at Angie's house. Hope she's okay. All right. Oh, hang on. The Triple A truck was in Angie's driveway. Boy, she's got a really nice little uh, Toyota Highlander, you know.
Nice. This little brush is working good. You guys want to see what I'm doing on this side here? Yeah, I'll show you. Okay. Yeah, let me move the camera around. So what I'm doing is getting all this little bit of cheese. Ah, Come on, Paul. I'm getting these little pieces of rust that's in here that I didn't have masks. Do, uh, that's okay. You know, I'm gonna have to. I know there's another piece of trim I'm missing. Um, I'm gonna have to go back down to Brandywine and look for. There's a little piece right here that's missing. not such a good paint job here but it's the best I can do okay that's all right though because I the touch up paint will cover it all up so we'll be good all righty well get a little bit more there should we get all the little rust spots off Whoop. Oh, that's terrible. Oh my goodness. That looks so grody, but that's all right. That's, I mean, it's functional. I mean, I got the rust off the rusty spots, but uh, it's uh, kind of, did I get them all? I think so. Just right everything. Okay. But the uh, the touch-up paint will cover that up nicely. Alrighty, it's looking good. So it's been a couple minutes for the other one, so let me. Okay, let me go back around here and hit these with uh, a second coat. <laughs> there we go. Huh. So let's uh, put a lid on this thing here. I got, I got to clean all this stuff up. I got rags and sandpaper and different things uh, got to clean that up so right now we are just going to uh, uh, let this dry for a day and uh, let's see this paint's not going to touch anything is it no not at all okay and I tell you what I do have to get I need the little thing that goes in there. Let me go around the back to show you. Okay. Yeah. There it is right there. That's it right there. So I need that little thing right there. Oh, is that one on there? Let me check. Okay, yeah. So uh, this one is here. Nice. Okay. Okay. 